Scientists have finally done what was once thought impossible. They captured the first image of black hole. But now that black holes have become easier to spot, researchers have found one hiding very close to Earth. Is it dangerous? Is it headed our way? Are there any other black holes out there lurking close to us? In case you're not familiar with these great devourers of the universe, black holes form when massive stars 8 to 15 times more massive than the Sun collapse after running out of fuel. Some create powerful supernova that eject material outward in all directions at almost the speed of light. But some stars simply collapse into dark black holes without a supernova. During collapse, the core of the star begins to compress its gravitational center without ever stopping. The newly formed black hole becomes so dense that its gravitational forces become incredibly strong, pulling it into any object that comes too close. The forces of gravity in a black hole are so strong that even light cannot escape it. And now it's just been discovered that there's a black hole just 1,000 light years from Earth. Located in the Telescopium constellation near Sagittarius, it's the closest black hole to the planet Earth ever found. By comparison, the black hole at the center of the Milky Way is 25,000 light years away. This black hole might be too close for comfort. While a thousand light years might sound distant, in cosmic distances, it's very close. It's so close that you can see the star system without a telescope from the southern hemisphere on a dark, clear night with the naked eye. HR 6819 is a triple binary system that is made up of two stars that orbit a black hole. At first, it was thought that this was a simple binary system with just two stars orbiting each other. But after analyzing the data, something very unusual was found about the behavior of the inner star of HR 6819. The velocity of this star was so extreme that the astronomers suspected a third object must be sitting close by which was flinging the stars around like a slingshot with incredible force. European astronomers finally found evidence for a mysterious large invisible object with a mass estimated to be 4.2 times the mass of the Sun by tracking the two companion stars using the MPG ESO 2.2 meter telescope at ESO's La Silla Observatory in Chile. To everyone's surprise, it was found that the two stars were actually orbiting a stellar mass black hole around 25 miles in diameter that was formed by the gravitational collapse of a star. The inner star, whose orbit is shown in blue, and the black hole in red look as though they're chasing each other. But they're actually orbiting each other. The inner star completes a loop every 40 days, while the outer star travels on a wider orbit. Is this black hole dangerous? Upon further study, the hidden black hole in HR 6819 was found to be one of the very first stellar mass black holes that do not interact violently with its environment and, therefore, appears truly black. Is it moving towards us? While this black hole is really close to Earth in terms of space, it poses no harm to Earth at the present time and is not moving through space. You may be wondering if there are any other black holes hiding out there, just waiting to suck up our solar system. The discovery of the black hole in HR 6819 so close to Earth is just the beginning and provides clues about where we might find other black holes in the Milky Way. It's estimated there may be hundreds of millions of these universe eaters, and astronomers have spotted around a couple of dozen black holes in our galaxy. But that isn't the first time that a black hole has been found lurking close to Earth. But before we're able to directly image black holes, the only way they could be detected was if the black hole was feeding. This creates a ring of fire called an accretion disk that's caused by heavy gravitational and frictional forces compressing and heating the matter of a star or planet as it falls into the black hole. Before the black hole in HR 6819 was discovered, the next closest black hole to Earth was V616 Monocerotis, which is 3,000 light years away. V616 Mon is around 9 to 13 times larger than the Sun, and previously you could only see this black hole because it's located in a binary star system that's close to a detectable star that moves in a unique pattern and is orbiting the black hole. Because it has a lot of mass, it has an incredibly strong gravitational pull. 
Cygnus X1 is another black hole that's close to Earth and is actually considered the first black hole discovered. It was first found in the constellation Cygnus in 1964. It's also famous because the late great astrophysicist Stephen Hawking bet another physicist that it wasn't a black hole. But Hawking lost the bet and in 2011 it was established as a black hole. Cygnus X1 has 14.8 times the solar mass of the Sun, but only measures 18 miles wide. It lies about 6,070 light years away from us and is the most brilliant high energy X-ray source in the heavens. It spins at 800 revolutions per second and is sucking the gas from a closely orbiting supergiant blue star, which has a size of 19.2 solar masses and is 300,000 times brighter than the Sun. The gas heats as it's getting sucked into the black hole, forming an accretion disk and emitting bursts of high-energy X-rays and gamma rays through jets. Here's a video about what's happening with Cygnus X1 and the Super Blue Giant. For a long time, we could only guess what a black hole must really look like, since it's nearly impossible to image an object that light cannot escape from. But technology has been advancing by leaps and bounds. And on April the 10th, 2019, astronomers obtained the first ever image of a black hole located in a galaxy called Messier 87. In the image, you can see the bright halo of gas surrounding the dark object in the center. But it's not just any black hole. It's a monster that measures 24 billion miles across. That's three million times the size of Earth and has a mass 6.5 billion times of the Sun. It could quite possibly be the biggest black hole that exists. But thankfully this giant monster is 53.49 million light years away, or 16.4 million passes from Earth. How the photograph was taken is an incredible feat. Scientists always thought they could image a black hole by capturing their shadows against the glowing surroundings. But this technology wasn't available until now. Everyone knows that the larger a telescope, the greater its ability to gather more light and the higher its resolution will be. So how do you create the largest telescope in the world so it can image a black hole? A team was put together to take on this challenge and created a network of an array of smaller telescopes that can all be synchronized to focus on the same object in space at the same time. They call this the Event Horizon Telescope and have improved upon imaging faraway objects, which is known as the Very Long Baseline Interferometry Technique. This new powerful telescope is as large as the distance between the two farthest telescope stations. One is at the South Pole and the other in Spain, which created an aperture nearly the same diameter of Earth, about 24,901 miles. This same team is now working on trying to image the supermassive black hole at the center of our own galaxy, Sagittarius A star, which is 4.1 million times the size of the Sun. However, therein lies a great mystery, because for some unknown reason, the ring of fire around the black hole at the heart of the Milky Way is smaller and dimmer. Since we now have the technology to directly image black holes now, there's a good chance we could find them hiding everywhere. There definitely could be a black hole even closer to us than 1,000 light years. But black holes are still notoriously difficult to detect, which makes them dangerous because you don't need to be that close to be affected. A black hole can reach out through light years with its incredible gravitational forces. And if a planet gets too close, it could be obliterated, vaporized, or flung into an entirely new area of space. It's been discovered that black holes like the stellar mass HR6819 can move. Rapidly moving black holes that are flying through space are essentially impossible to detect because space is very big. Could a black hole be heading our way? The truth is, no one would know until it might be too late. And if you can see stars being warped from a black hole, you're already too close. But for now, there isn't anything to worry about. In the meantime, if you want to try and find HR6819, use a star map or star map application and find the constellation of Telescopium. It'll appear as a single bright object since the two stars are so close together. Of course, you won't be able to see the black hole itself, 
but you can know you're staring right at it. As technology and methods improve, closer black holes to Earth will inevitably be discovered. We hope you enjoyed the video. To keep up on the latest exciting news about Earth and the universe around us, click subscribe and turn notifications on so you'll be the first to know when cool things are happening. Thanks for watching.